when you turn up, okay, guys, um, whether it's in your personal statement or your equivalent in, in countries abroad, or if you turn up for an interview, all right, please don't do any of this, okay? The number of times you'll find people who will kind of commit these fundamental sins is unbelievable. And you might think, oh my God, how can that be the case? But believe me, when you're nervous, when you're anxious, people say some funny things. I don't want you to tell me that you want to do medicine, you want to do dentistry because daddy is a dentist or daddy is a doctor. You mustn't do that, all right? That comes across as an entitled person, all right? And as I said to you before, it's not something we um, advise people to do. Do not necessarily talk about the fact that, oh, I want to be a doctor because you'll never be unemployed as a doctor, all right? I want to be a dentist because there's such a shortage of dentists, I'll always be in a job. No, that's really not very motivating or, yes, it's a fact, we get that, okay? Although in recent years, um, in some countries for, for certain situations like the COVID situation, um, you found actually doctors have been out of work, all right? So it's not always true, but I know what you mean, they know what you mean, everybody knows what you mean. In most countries of the world, doctors will always be in work. So will dentists and so will vets. But guys, we don't need to focus on that. There's better motivation to talk about. Um, money, please don't go there. I hate it, everybody hates it, all right? It's a fact. Dentists, vets, medics, all right? You'll be okay. For money, you won't do so badly in life. But does that have to be your motivational factor in an interview situation? Uh -uh. I don't think so. All right, so for those of you who put that down on your list, cross it off now, okay? I do not think you should mention it. Okay, dad, um, telling you to apply for medicine. <laughs> um, to be fair, to be fair, to be fair, I don't come across this um, often, but it's just sometimes you come across this. No, look, you wanna do medicine, it's because you want to do it. You're motivated, not because you're being told by people. You probably shouldn't be there if your dad is forcing you into it, or your mum is doing, or whoever, please, don't do that. That should not be the reason for doing medicine, dentistry, vet medicine. If that's the case, personally, I would advise you not to do uh, the career full stop. Um, fame and prestige, what do you think about that? Yeah, I thought so. You, all of you are nodding in the horizontal. Definitely not. If you want to be a famous person, if you want to do for the prestige, you might as well become a YouTuber, okay? You might as well become an influencer. You'll probably make more money as, at the same time as well, okay? You're in, um, you're in for the wrong reasons, if that's why you're coming into medicine, dentistry, and uh, veterinary medicine. Um, second career, uh, uh, again, if you're doing it because you didn't get into law, uh, you couldn't become a city trader or whatever, come on guys. Even if it's true, let's not talk about this, all right? Let's not bring this up, because as an interviewer, if I hear this from you, if I get those vibes, I doubt I want you there, when actually there is, um, for that very university place you're gonna take up, there's five or six other people who will gladly take it, all right? You're not the right person. That's what you're telling me, okay? And also other choice. Now in the UK, this is UK specific, all right? There are similar schemes, I'm not going to go into it in detail. Um, you don't have to mention every single choice you've made um, in your university interviews, all right? When you go to, for example, let's say you've gone to Birmingham University for your interview, let's focus on Birmingham. Let's not talk about how you wanted to go to Manchester, how you wanted to go to Melbourne, how you wanted to go to Toronto. Okay, that's not what we're going to talk about. We're going to talk about that university, we'll keep it at that, and that's how we will get our university place.